Hey boys, how we doing tonight? It's me, YD, back with another video. I got two more in the mail today, and I can't wait to open them, so let's jump right into it. Obviously, one's an artisan, one's a concept. I'm going to open the artisan first. <clears throat> this is actually the first artisan knife I have bought. I have plenty of CJRBs, I just have no artisans until now. Okay. Let's see if can we can we read that. Model 1856P AR RPM 9, 59 to 61 hardness. You see that right there, boys? G10. I can't help myself. I love it now. Ceramic ball bearing, CNC machine processing really like this bag I'm pretty impressed with that bag it's almost like one of them crown royal bags it's got the nice stitching on it nice little lace things but unfortunately that will just be sitting in a crate what's inside is what matters Ooh. all right I'd like to shout out that budget guy, KT, on YouTube. I'm watching a couple of his videos. He had a video about this knife. He got some custom scale work done on. This is the C. Oh, nope. Not CJRB. Whoops. The Artisan Cutlery Andromeda. Ooh, guys. That feels really good. Oh, the action. Jimping on the spine, pretty nice. I like the blade shape. Man, it's pretty light. Alright, I gotta do it. Okay. Under three ounces, 2.99. It feels really good. That action is incredible. Button lock feels really good too. Well, obviously, they mastered button locks. Ooh, I really, really like that one. Let's grab this baby. Concept for safety purposes for now. have two other concepts so I know how the packaging comes I do really like how they package these this nice little you know flap with the uh, holder in it Ooh, this is the one I was on the fence about <clears throat> the model is concept what is it model six yeah, the Model 6. Obviously, Black G10. Your boy can't help himself anymore. But, ooh, I like that backspacer. Concept Model 6. Ooh. Oh. Little bit tight. Trying to get used to it. Ooh, that does feel good. I was really debating this one because I saw it in the uh, like blue and red nebula carbon fiber, you know, and I wasn't really trying to spend that much money on a knife I didn't know if I would like. I just really couldn't spend like 160 or whatever it was. I mean, it feels good. The two other concepts I have are kind of like weird shape. This one's not like weird per se. The grind is kind of funky. Like a weird angle. Kind of going like that. Like the backspacer. Decent jimping. I like the pocket clip. The pocket clip looks pretty nice. Roll. 
You just gotta give it a little oomph on the flipper tab. It does have some jimping, but... Yeah, not the most. Ooh, yeah. Oh, I... Just based off first impressions, I definitely like the artisan more. I love the shape. You know, that's very, like, dagger-y, dagger ish something like that. Man, it feels good. I really do like this concept. I bought this one specifically to go into my G10 collection because I've seen so many other concepts with crazy materials, so... I just wanted to buy a plain Jane one to go in my black G10 collection. These two will definitely fit in great. Yeah, I bet you when this puppy breaks in a little bit more, that will be... Super drop shetty. This artisan just works. It just works real nice. I guess I haven't tried to reverse flick it. Okay. Yep. Yep, she hits. Guess we should wait. Concept two. Three point nine seven. Yes, yeah, so that's about an ounce heavier. But that will be it for me, guys. Just wanted to show you what I got in the mail today. Like I said, it's my first artisan knife. And I do really like this. Uh, I have to look into more. You know, I like buying budget knives, but every now and again, I gotta spend a little bit more. The concept's pretty nice, too. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Appreciate every single one of you. Please like, please subscribe. See you in the next one.